right, quick question. First question. Uh, were you guys trying to have a contest who could score more points between you, Mongoose, Mick, and Miles? Because, dude, you're putting up points tonight, like, how, I, how they expect trying. you to put points up. I'm trying to. I loved yeah. it. Uh, we just been preaching in the room, like, just no matter what, just trying to score. Just trying to create wrestling. And it's catching on, so I love it. Travell has been awesome with just getting us in the right mindset to just keep attacking and not being afraid to get tired and stuff, so. Undefeated on the year for you. Yeah, so far. Having a good year so far, obviously coming out. And, and you know, hey, the grind hasn't really yeah. caught you yet. But um, as far as cutting weight, it doesn't look like you're a gigantic 97. No. <laughs> How's that? Uh, weight's not an issue at all. So I'm still eating like two or three meals a day, up to day of weigh-ins, not so much. But eating really good, working out, a lot of energy. So that's not really a big deal. Uh, strength is good too, so... Those big guys, I, can, I don't have too much trouble with. But I work out with Kyle a lot, so I'm used to the, the strength. He's a horse. Yeah. But it looked like you had some of those. You guys are all like Miles is doing it, you're doing it. Terrell does that little low shot that he does. And then obviously Kyle does the little low shot. You know, he won the world title with it. And that's how he's able to, you know, he, he gets those guys to tax them low, works up the body. But do you think that that stuff's rubbing off on you, some of those offense that those guys hit? Big time. Big time. Uh, Travell and Jaggers have been doing awesome, just technique all preseason. And a lot of it was a lot of setups, the little shots. And uh, they seem to work. I mean, Kyle works with Kyle, works with Travell, the both might be in. So why not try it? I love the little the little dump and the little uh, the barrel roll fireman. It still works. Yeah. Um, you know, obviously guys are gonna scout that, pick up on it, and, and you know you're not a guy, you're not a one trick pony. But um, what have you developed? You know, like what do you think you learned from world championships? You know, um, obviously Russian guys can do somersaults. <laughs> we know that, right? Big time. They can flip you around and you don't know what's happening. But you know, what do you think you learned? Obviously, the training was much greater than a guy catching you in some weird move and doing a bunch of cartwheels and flips, right? What do you think you learned from the World Championships? Um, well, really, all summer. So I was at the training center three weeks out of the summer, and uh, just had a bunch of good guys in Ohio State's room all summer working out with Kyle, and I got to experience that and learn from it. So just awesome coaches and awesome wrestlers being around them. Just picked up a lot of technique and just worked really hard all summer. Like, so I never really slowed down, so I just feel like I'm ready to go right now. Feels like they could have pulled you in the red shirt last year. Kind of what happened in 97 was a little weird with you guys. Um, what did that red shirt year do for you? Uh, red shirt year was amazing for me. I really needed it. Uh, going from my high school room, no offense, but uh, it's like eight guys in there and not really a lot to push me. And then going to Ohio State, and Big Ten, NCAA wrestling. Uh, it was it was a bit of a shock. So that whole year, just working out with Kyle, and Miles, and Travell, and JD Bergman. JD was in there. Yeah, He's strong. It, it was crazy good room. So it just got me really tough. I feel. Uh, looking at you, you know, talking about high school room. Let's talk about your dad. Yeah. Your dad is a horse. Was a was a st two time state champ for Chanel. One time. One time, but you know, wrestled at Division One at Michigan State. Uh, can you get dad yet? I always ask the Jordans, can they get their dad? Your dad is a horse. He scares me when I see him. He, He's a he big, strong-looking dude still. He had double knee surgery in March, so I think I can get him now. He's Just move a bunch? So much. Just move uh, a bunch? If you get to hold of me, I don't know. <laughs> He's really strong. He works hard. What's next for you guys? Vegas. Vegas? Yeah. You got anything else for me? Uh, glad to have Coach Ralph in there. Anthony Ralph. Dude, Ralph. high school, college teammate of mine. Yeah. College teammate. Mac champ here at Kent State. Awesome ask, dude. ask him 157. 157. Stud, mean guy. All right? Yeah. All right, thanks for the time. Good luck. Thank you.